The origins of Clan Preston can be traced back to lands that were likely associated with a church or monastery, often referred to as the priest's town. The name Preston itself signifies this connection, as it essentially means the priest's town. This suggests that the clan may have been connected to religious establishments or ecclesiastical lands in its early history. One of the earliest records of the Preston name dates back to 1222 when a man named Lilf held land in Linlithgow, which he generously donated to the Abbey of New Battle. This act of philanthropy highlights the clan's early involvement with religious institutions and the broader community. Clan Preston also produced several notable figures throughout history. Sir John de Preston, he participated in David II's foray into England in 1346 and was captured at the Battle of Durham. His subsequent imprisonment in the Tower of London, and eventual release after paying a hefty ransom exemplify the turbulent times in which the clan lived. Sir Simon de Preston, in 1374, he purchased Craig Miller Castle, a majestic fortress located southeast of Edinburgh. This castle became one of Mary, Queen of Scots' favourite residences and played a significant role in Scottish history. Sir William Preston of Craigmiller, he was a member of the Scottish Parliament that convened in Edinburgh in 1478, contributing to the political life of the nation. Sir Charles Preston, the fifth baronet, he played a role in the American War of Independence and commanded Fort John, demonstrating the clan's involvement in international affairs. Craigmiller Castle, which the Prestons owned for centuries, still stands today, although in ruins. This impressive structure dominates the surrounding countryside and serves as a reminder of the clan's historical significance. Additionally, the Preston family's restoration efforts at Coorus Abbey near Dunfermline have preserved a magnificent piece of Scottish vernacular architecture. Coorus Abbey is now under the care of the National Trust for Scotland. Beyond their involvement in political and military affairs, the Prestons also made significant contributions to their communities. Sir Simon Preston's efforts to secure a charter for the Trinity Church and Hospital, in Edinburgh, aimed at assisting the poor, exemplify their commitment to social welfare.